Robert St. Keter, and welcome to BAM! Vinyl and Music News, where we talk about vinyl, music, well, we haven't talked about vinyl in a little bit, but vinyl, music, and music news, and, uh, yeah. So, tonight I was originally gonna talk about anti-Valentine's Day songs and anti-Valentine's Day playlists, because, did you know, I mentioned about that whole country playlist, I found a whole slew of other playlists, and this kind of got me thinking about songs that are kind of like anti-Valentine's Day, or songs to basically tell somebody F you to, but then I went on Facebook, and uh, one of my co-workers, I guess slash friends at work, uh, posted something, a quote, and the quote came off of a Facebook page uh, from um, Baruch Assault, and if you're familiar with music, you know who Baruch Assault is, and if you're not... I I think you should Google it. It's worth the wild. It's worth your wild to discover '90s mus '90s females, female musicians. Um. Anyway. Uh. So I just I I sat there and I saw Veruca Salt and I was like, ooh, Veruca Salt. And this led me down. At first, it was just a rabbit hole, and then it became a black hole, and then it just became kind of like I'm going Nova. I'm stuck in here. Because I started recalling a bands that I hadn't even thought of in a long, long, long time. Like, um, Annie DeFranco, 32 Flavors, uh, Melissa Etheridge, who I haven't heard in a while, and I used to really, really love her music. Um, uh, Paula Cole, uh, Sarah McLaughlin, Alice M Lattice Morissette, uh, Sean Colvin, just to name a few. Billy Myers, uh, that woman's voice. Um, there's so many female artists from the 90s that I could sit there and I could recall in my head and listening to and just going, man, these ladies are fucking awesome. I mean, Stevie Nicks, uh, Jewel was one of them. Granted, Jewel, early Jewel was cool. Later Jewel was just kind of like, what happened? Um, and this kind of sidetracked my video for tonight. But it kind of got me thinking about female 90s artists and granted, I wanted to talk about female artists next month, but this gave me a whole slew of ideas, which is kind of like, yes, awesome. But it got me thinking, what female artists from the 90s did you absolutely love? Um, leave them down below. Um, I will leave a playlist down below, and I will try to link it somewhere up in here. I'm not sure if those links work exactly on other mobile devices. Like, granted, I know they work on some, but not all, so I'm like, are they worthwhile? I don't know. We'll try it. Uh, but... I will leave a playlist of like 90s female music so you can just reminisce with me. Um, I was thinking of Bjork and we got into this whole conversation of like Bjork and Bjork's music and were you a fan? Were you not a fan? Did you like Bjork? Um, it got me kind of thinking about just like 90s female music in general and just 90s music in general and just how awesome it was. But then again, maybe I'm biased because I was an 80s baby. That could totally be a thing. Anyway, um, let me know down below. What are some female artists that you loved from the 90s? And also let me know, did you like Bjork? Did you not like Bjork? Anyway, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys are doing awesome. And check out the playlist down below if you weren't born in... If you were born in the 2000s, because that's a thing. And you never knew about the 90s. Um, I'll leave a link down there for you guys. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys are doing awesome. Bye! <laughs> Whatever it is that you believe you're seeing, it's not, 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 not real. Seeing things before they happen. Things are not always what they seem in this place. So you can't take anything for granted.